Stephen Klein's reality-bending photographs have never been more pertinent. Readers are invited to open Stephen Klein's new book with the same trepidation they might enter a booby-trapped house. Danger emanates from within, writes the author, Mark Holborn, in the foreword. Danger emanates from within, scenes from the enigmatic photographer's first monograph include, but are not limited to, nudity, gender fluidity, pyromania and murder. Bodies are contorted, faces are masked and the world's most beautiful are superficially aged as Klein toes the line between fiction and reality. Nothing or nobody is off-limits in Klein's world, where the upper echelons of Hollywood are no longer celebrities, but characters in his sequences. Blink and you might miss Linda Evangelista in Head to Toe Bondage or Karen Elson as a sexy amphibian. For Klein, who oscillates between static and moving images, the face can be distracting. He prefers his subjects to look away, to make the viewer look at parts less studied and bring a new kind of unsettling intimacy to the lives of the rich and famous. The camera is a time machine not documenting reality but interpreting it, Klein says. The camera is a time machine not documenting reality but interpreting it. It was while holidaying in Miami, age 13, that Klein borrowed his father's Instamatic camera and navigated his way into a bar. One portrait of a stripper later and Klein was enraptured by what he saw, and the power his camera granted him. From America's dark underworld to voyeuristic moments capturing Kim Kardashian in various states of undress, Klein's sphere, like his imagination, has expanded immeasurably since. Among the gloss and gore there are tropes that hark back to that inquisitive boy with the instamatic. The use of surgical metal in his imagery recalls the feeling of hard iron on his skin as a child wearing leg braces, but if there's even a hint of self-portraiture he keeps us guessing. The book has been more than five years in the making and its journey a poignant one. Klein and Holborn began discussing the 282 photo tome before the Trump administration. People's perception of life has changed, Klein's photography and its urgent, challenging nature have become more timely. His portrayal of society, from the police brutality to the raging fires, is not so apocalyptic when we're living it.